Oh, Pizza Man's here. Do I look okay? Ordering takeout is more popular than ever, and you can get an impressive choice of foods. So get ready to work up an appetite as you digest this list of the top 10 most popular takeout foods. This is not what I ordered. Pizza. Pizza Man! Pizza Man! I got pizza here! Who wants pizza, man? Pizza has long been one of the most popular foods around. There's a pizza out there for everyone, regardless of your taste. Everyone has their own opinion about what makes the best pizza crust. People can argue forever about the pros and cons of thick crust, thin crust, gluten-free crust, and crust stuffed with cheese. Once the crust debate is settled, there is the cheese. Fresh mozzarella and parmesan are just two of the most common cheeses used on pizza, but the only limit is your own particular taste. Most pizzas aren't complete until the toppings are added, and it seems like just about every day brings a new pizza topping. Pizza time. Even if you want to keep it classic, there are still plenty of toppings to choose from, including pepperoni, sausage, mushroom, and onions. A personal pizza is a great meal for one person, but pizza is a great choice for takeout if you need to feed a hungry group. Whether you're gathering to watch the big game or a movie, you can easily order a few large pizzas with different toppings and keep everyone happy. This combination of versatility and flavor makes pizza a crowd favorite and easily makes it one of the most popular takeout foods. Talk about pizza's versatility. Not many foods are great for lunch, dinner, and even cold for breakfast the next day. Sushi. Japanese chefs. We don't like to brag, but... Sushi is a traditional Japanese meal with deep roots in this Far East nation. For a long time, it only enjoyed limited appeal in places like America, but in the past few decades, it has exploded in popularity. Today, some of the most popular restaurants in your town are probably sushi places. Sushi is built around a variety of uncooked fresh fish and other light ingredients such as rice. Two of the most popular kinds of sushi are nigiri and sashimi. Nigiri is slightly sliced raw fish that is pressed on top of sushi rice. Sashimi is just thin slices of fish like tuna or salmon. Does that seem fishy to you? Some of the more popular items at sushi restaurants include California rolls and Philly rolls. These items, as well as other kinds of sushi, are a lot lower in calories and fat than traditional American takeout, such as hamburgers and pizza. The fact that it is seen as a healthy alternative is a big part of sushi's success in America, but there's also the idea that it is somewhat exotic and exclusive when compared with sandwiches and other basic fare. Some people are reluctant to try raw fish, while there are others who don't really like cooked fish, but have discovered they love sushi. Sushi's explosion and popularity made it clear that it's one of the most popular takeout foods. Tacos. But I'm not a soft taco. I'm a hard, horny taco. Whether you're enjoying a taco with a crunchy corn shell or a soft taco made with a wheat tortilla, tacos are a convenient, handheld food that is easy to eat on the go. One of the great things about tacos are the possibilities. The soft and hard shells are just the first step to creating a delicious taco. This takeout food can be filled with any meat, from chicken to steak to pork. Of course, cheese is a popular filling in tacos, but lettuce, tomato, and onions are popular additions to tacos as well. You want to go to Taco Bell? There are a whole range of different salsas, from mild to extra spicy and red and green varieties of salsa. Once you pick your tacos, you can pair them with some chips and salsa or guacamole. With the popularity of tacos, we can't forget its cousin, the quesadilla. You can think of a quesadilla essentially as a flat, soft taco. Quesadillas offer the same versatility as tacos and the same variety when it comes to cheeses, vegetables, meats, and salsas. Tacos and quesadillas are both great choices for a quick takeout meal that promises to satisfy a wide variety of tastes. Chow mein. 
Mom, no, I don't want Chinese lunch. I want white people food. Chow mein has its origins in China, but it has become popular in many places, including America, where it was introduced by Chinese immigrants in the 19th century. The dish consists of stir-fried vegetables, bean sprouts, and noodles, as well as a choice of meat or tofu. Many people top it off with a serving of soy sauce, but there are many ways to enjoy this simple but satisfying dish. It's the mix of ingredients and spices that makes this this dish popular with so many people. There are two main versions of chow mein available in America, steamed and crispy. Steamed chow mein is, as you might expect, softer and uses round noodles. Chinese food, no soul food here. The crispy chow mein is known for its somewhat crispier texture and for using fried flat noodles. Chow mein often includes some combination of onions, celery, carrots, and water chestnuts, but it can be modified to accommodate different tastes. Whether you prefer to eat this dish with chopsticks or a fork, chow mein is a complete and satisfying meal that can be enjoyed using just a single bowl. The combination of meat, noodles, and vegetables is simply hard to beat. Burgers. Hey, can I get a... The hamburger has long been the king of fast food chains. Whether you go to global restaurant chains like McDonald's or Burger King or a mom and pop cafe, hamburgers are featured prominently on the menus. Hamburgers come in many shapes, sizes, and varieties, but the foundation of a great hamburger is the beef. Round, square, fried, charbroiled, one patty, two patties, or more, these are just some of the ways you can get a hamburger for takeout. The beef patty is the foundation of most good hamburgers, but for those who want a different version, there are plenty of vegetarian options. Freeze! Vegan police! Vegan police! You can also get burgers made from ground turkey and chicken. Most people agree that a good bun or roll is also key. From a basic roll to pretzel bun, there are many choices here as well. Perhaps the only thing more popular than a hamburger is a cheeseburger. American cheese is a favorite, but there is a cheese for every taste. Regardless of whether you choose cheese or without cheese, you have a lot of other toppings to choose from, including classics like tomato tomato, lettuce, pickles, onions, and mayonnaise. You can also choose from ketchup, mustard, bacon, chili peppers, and of course, that mysterious special sauce that so many burger places use. Pasta. Now if you'll excuse me, I'm gonna ride this rigatoni into the sky. Pasta can cover a lot of ground, and this is one of the reasons it is such a popular food. Spaghetti, macaroni, whole wheat, fresh made, and spinach are just some of the varieties of pasta to choose from. This is just the beginning, because after you choose the kind of pasta you want, there is an almost never-ending list of sauces and other toppings to put on the pasta. There is the ever-popular tomato sauce, which itself has so many variations. But there are also the different cream and cheese-based sauces, such as Alfredo. Feel this chicken isn't that bad. Some people prefer just a dash of olive oil or some butter with a sprinkling of pepper, oregano, or other spices. But after choosing a sauce, you're still not done because there's also all the different meat and vegan options that help to make pasta such a versatile and beloved dish. With all this variety and versatility, pasta is a hearty enough food to be a main dish on its own, but it can also be light enough to be a tasty side dish that doesn't overwhelm. This is true even if it's a big piece of chicken parmesan or a juicy cut of steak. It's easy to see why pasta has become such a popular takeout food. Burritos and burrito bowls. I will get you your chicken burrito. Mexican food is more popular than ever, and burritos help explain why. A wrapped-up tortilla is such a great way to get your fill of meat and toppings. Burritos have all the versatility of tacos, but the wrapped tortilla gives makers the confidence to stuff the inside with a range of meats and other toppings that includes onions, tomatoes, and lettuce. Chicken and beef are always popular choices for burritos, but it's common to see pork, fish, and vegan options. 
This burrito is delicious, but it is filling. Cheese, rice, and beans are all very popular fillings. These three hearty ingredients combine to make a tasty vegetarian burrito option that will certainly make for a satisfying takeout meal. Many burritos are topped off with some kind of hot sauce or salsa, and if that isn't enough, you can always dip your burrito in your favorite condiment. Burritos are a popular handheld takeout food, but if you prefer to eat with a fork, you can always order a burrito bowl. This lower carb and calorie option has all the fillings and toppings you enjoy in your favorite burrito, but they are piled into a bowl instead of wrapped inside a soft tortilla. Either version is a great choice for a tasty takeout meal whenever you get a craving for Mexican food. French fries. When you steal a fry from your friend, they can say, hey, I paid for those. French fries are usually thought of as a side dish that pairs perfectly with hamburgers and sandwiches. However, French fries can be a delicious dish on their own. Crinkle cut, wedge, and shoestring are just a few varieties of French fries. Ketchup is by far the most popular condiment when it comes to French fries, but some people prefer mayonnaise, ranch dressing, and even barbecue sauce. French fries are great by themselves, but you can also get them topped with cheese, chili, or both. Chili cheese fries are a hearty meal by themselves, but they also go great with any burger you would care to order. The possibilities are many, and if you're looking for a lighter form of french fries, there are some baked options to choose from, as well as ones made from vegetables, such as zucchini fries. Neither of these are really french fries, so most people will avoid them in favor of the real thing. Onion rings. However, onion rings are a deep-fried side with a crispy crunch that complements burgers very well if you're looking for a little break from french fries. French fries and onion rings are both salty treats that can be a delicious takeout food. Chicken. Is, is this chicken? Hell no. Chicken comes in many forms, including seared, baked, and fried. When it comes to versatile foods, chicken is at the top of the list and goes a long way toward putting it on the list of the most popular takeout foods. So many meals can be made better with the addition of chicken, including salads, pasta dishes, and even pizza. However, the king of chicken dishes has to be the classic favorite, fried chicken. This popular dish is a delicious combination of crunchy coating and tender, juicy meat. A lot of things go really well with fried chicken, including biscuits, mashed potatoes, macaroni and cheese, and coleslaw. Fried chicken, better with Pepsi. <sighs> Any or all of these foods will help to complete the perfect fried chicken takeout meal. Many people like to order sautéed chicken meals, baked chicken, or even air-fried chicken that has a lot of the flavor of fried chicken minus most of the fat. There are so many variations of chicken dishes that you could order different meals for takeout regularly before you start repeating yourself, so you might as well get started. Salads. Put a party of six, please. Yes, and we are hungry. Salads are essentially a complete meal in a bowl, so they can be a convenient choice for a quick but satisfying lunch or dinner. There are so many different kinds of salads, and the list of ingredients is almost endless, so there's pretty much a salad for every taste. You can choose from a Cobb salad, Chinese chicken salad, taco salad, chef salad, just to name a few choices. Salads are one of the more versatile foods because they can contain such a wide range of items that includes everything from lettuce and onions to beans and cheese. The vegetables and other ingredients are usually topped with some sort of dressing, and the sky's the limit here as well. Who goes to McDonald's and orders a salad? A lot of people like to top their salads with something like a heavy ranch dressing, but there are a lot of lighter options such as vinaigrettes. Regardless of your choice of dressing, you can always get it on the side if you're limiting your calories. Don't forget that a protein choice can be an important part of a salad, and it can come in a lot of different forms. This range of choices includes foods such as chicken, steak, bacon, eggs, and even nuts. Even if a salad isn't usually your first thought when you're considering placing an order, there are good reasons why it makes a popular takeout food. Got a takeout favorite we missed? Let us know! And tap on another great video, hit that subscribe button, and ring that notification bell.